Hi, myself Sudhir Kumbar, Assistant Professor, Department of Chemistry, Dahiwadi College, Dahiwadi. I welcome in this module named Electrochemistry. In this module, we are going to learn about in detail types of electrodes. In this module, we are going to learn about concept of electrode in detail and types of electrode in detail. Let's see first what is electrode. A electrode is a metal surface on which oxidation and reduction reaction occurs. The metal surface which acts as an electrode is divided into two parts or types. First type is inert electrode. The second type is active electrode. The example of inert electrode is a platinum electrode. This is served for an electrical contact purpose while the other type that is active metal it is served for an uh, surface or this provide surface for oxidation and reduction reaction. The examples of an electrodes are hydrogen gas electrode which is very common electrode silver silver chloride electrode and calomel electrode these are some common electrode which we are used in our laboratory where electrode is found the electrodes are important part of an cell the cell is the smallest device which are capable of conversion of electrical energy into chemical energy and chemical energy into electric energy. Therefore, the electrodes are found in electrochemical cells as well as in electrolytic cells. In electrochemical cell, chemical energy is converted into electrical energy while the electrolytic cell in which the electrical energy is converted into the chemical energy. Also, the electrodes are used in batteries or it is found in the batteries, the storage batteries. Let's see types of electrode. There are five types of electrodes. First one, metal metal ion electrode. Second one, amalgam electrode. Third one, metal metal insoluble salt electrode. Fourth one, gas electrode. Fifth one, redox electrode. Please remember these five types of electrode. These are basics of an any electrochemical cell or electrolytic cell or battery. Let's see first type of electrode, metal metal ion electrode. The metal metal ion electrode is represented as Mn plus aqueous slash M solid. Here Mn plus is metal ion and M is the metal. To construct metal or metal ion electrode, we require one beaker, the metal and the solution containing Mn plus ion. If you fill a beaker with Mn plus ion and when we dip metal into the solution of Mn plus ion, the metal metal ion electrode is formed. When metal metal ion is formed, the electrode reaction takes place. Mn plus gain n number of electron to form M solid. Here, the reduction reaction takes place. The ion accept n number of electron. It gives metal solid. The product it is a solid metal. That solid metal is deposited on the metal plate. The electrode EMF. The EMF of the metal metal ion electrode is theoretically represented by the Nernst equation. EC is equal to E0 minus 2.203 RT upon NF log base to 10 upon upon Mn plus. This is the concentration of Mn plus. Here the concentration of Mn plus it is related to the EMF of the electrode. Here EC is EMF of the electrode, E0 is the standard EMF of the electrode, R is the gas constant, T is the temperature in Kelvin, N is number of electrons involved in the electrode reaction, F is the Faraday's constant. 
and this is the concentration term. The other examples of metal metal ion electrodes are copper copper sulfate electrode represented by this representation, zinc zinc sulfate electrode represented by this representation. The next electrode is amalgam electrode. The amalgam electrode is represented as Mn plus aqueous and slash MHG, where Mn plus is a metal ion, MHG is a metal amalgam. For construction of amalgam electrode, we required a metal amalgam and a solution of metal ion. Also, one beaker. In a beaker, if you fill a solution of metal ion, and in that metal ion solution, if you place a metal amalgam electrode, then the amalgam electrode is formed. After formation of amalgam electrode, the electrode reaction takes place. It is a simple reduction reaction in which Mn plus ion gain n number of electrons and form amalgam, metal amalgam. This is the impure form of metal. It is not pure. In AMF equation, the electrode of the AMF of the electrode is represented by this equation EC is equal to E0 minus 2.303 RT upon NF log base to 10 of concentration of metal amalgam divided by concentration of metal ion. The EMF of this amalgam electrode is depend upon the ratio of concentration of these two terms. The examples of this amalgam electrodes are the first example is very famous example. The amalgam electrode is used in Wishton cell, the cadmium amalgam and the lead amalgam. These two amalgams are used in a Wishton standard cell. This is one of the cell which are used in potentiometry for standardization purpose. Second one is zinc amalgam and this is the Wishton standard cell containing zinc amalgam and lead amalgam. The next type of electrode is metal metal insoluble salt electrode. This electrode can be represented as X minus aqueous slash MX solid slash M solid. X minus is halide ion. MX is a metal insoluble salt and M is a metal. Construction. For construction of metal metal insoluble salt electrode, we required a metal, then the metal insoluble salt and the anion, the electrolyte containing common anion. A metal electrode in contact when we place metal electrode in contact with an insoluble salt of a metal, this congregation is then held in contact with a solution containing the anion X minus of the insoluble salt common. Electrode reaction Mx solid plus electron it gives M solid plus X minus ion where Mx is a insoluble salt of metal M is a metal and X minus is a halide ion when this electrode reaction takes place the EMF is generated that EMF is theoretically represented by Nernst equation. EC is equal to E0 minus 2.303 RT upon NF log base to 10 of concentration of X minus ion. In case of metal metal insoluble salt electrode, the EMF of the electrode is depend upon the concentration of the halide ion generated during the electrode reaction. The examples of this metal metal insoluble salt electrode is the first example is saturated calomel electrode which is one of the common electrode in potentiometric uh, experiments. The saturated calomel electrode contains platinum wire, mercury, mercurous chloride and saturated KCL. This platinum wire is served for an electrical contact purpose. Mercury is a metal, mercurous chloride is a 
metal insoluble salt and saturated KCl is a electrolyte. The second type of metal, metal insoluble salt electrode is silver silver chloride electrode. It contains silver, silver chloride and KCl. The silver is a metal, silver chloride is a metal insoluble salt and KCl is a <coughs> electrolytic solution. The next type of electrode is a gas electrode. Let's see example of gas electrode, hydrogen gas electrode. The representation of hydrogen gas electrode is H plus aqueous slash H2 gas slash platinum. The platinum electrode is served for electrical contact purpose. The hydrogen gas at particular pressure and this is the H plus ion concentration in the electrolyte. In construction of this gas electrode, we require a platinum electrode in the form of wire. The gas that is the hydrogen gas and the electrolyte containing H plus ion. When we bubble the hydrogen gas over this platinum wire, they are dipped into the solution containing H plus ion. Then the gas electrode is formed. The gas electrode reactions is for hydrogen gas electrode H plus aqueous gain one electron to form half H2 gas. The electrode EMF that can be represented theoretically by this equation EC is equal to E0 minus 2.303 RT upon NF log base to 10 upon upon H plus ion. That means the EMF that is generated due to the hydrogen gas electrode is directly proportional to the H plus ion concentration. The other examples of gas electrodes are chlorine gas electrode represented by this representation, oxygen gas electrode is represented by this electrode uh, representation. This is the hydrogen gas electrode. This is the beaker. In beaker, we fill the HCl solution containing H plus ion and this is the hydrogen gas electrode. This is the platinum electrode wire and through this inlet, we insert H2 gas at one atmospheric pressure and this H2 gas bubbled over this platinum wire which is dipped into the solution containing H plus ion. The EMF is generated on this hydrogen gas electrode represented by this equation. The last electrode is redox electrode. Let's see example of redox electrode ferrous ferric ion electrode. The ferrous ferric ion electrode is represented by the representation. This bracket, this bracket contain ferrous divided by ferric ion slash platinum. Platinum is served for electrical contact purpose and the bracket is the solution containing two different ions of iron. In order to construct redox electrode, we need one in the inert electrode like platinum and the solution that containing ferrous as well as ferric ion. First we take a beaker that filled with a solution con solution of Fe3 plus and Fe2 plus and when we insert one inert electrode into the this solution then the redox electrode that is ferrous ferric ion electrode is constructed or formed. When the redox electrode is constructed the electrode reaction takes place. The electrode reaction is reduction reaction. The Fe3 plus ion gain one electron to form Fe2 plus ion. Here reduction takes place. After reduction reaction, the EMF is generated on the redox electrode e is represented by this equation AC is equal to E0 minus 2.303 RT upon F. Here N is equal to 1 because in this reaction the number of electron is 1. That is why here the value of N is taken as a 1. 
into log base to 10 of concentration of AP2 plus divided by concentration of AP3 plus. Here, the EMF of the electrode is directly proportional to the ratio of ferrous to ferric ion. The other examples are stannous, stannic ion electrode. Here also, platinum electrode serve as a inert electrode. The construction of this electrode is same. These are some references. Thank you.